Welcome to today's DDRX. I want to wrap up the series on forgiveness. And I've come up with ABC of forgiveness. Don't forget unforgiveness is a poison. It is like having a dead skunk in your garage or in your basement. It makes the whole house stink. So it's to forgive is as simple as ABC. So the A is avoid revenge. Avoid revenge. Someone said, if you want to go on a journey of revenge, make sure you dig two graves. So as much as possible, do not revenge. Paul wrote in Romans 12, 19, Beloved, do not avenge yourselves, but rather give place to wrath. For it is written, vengeance is mine, I will repay says the Lord. So to forgive, remove revenge from your life. Then B of ABC of forgiveness is build bridges. What do I mean? Bridges of love, build bridges of unity, build bridges of reconciliation, build bridges of peace and harmony. In Romans 12, 18, Paul also wrote, if it is possible, as much as depends on you, live peaceably with all men. And Jesus also encouraged us in Matthew 18, 15 to 18. He said, moreover, if your brother sin against you, go and tell him his fault between you and him alone. If he hears you, you have gained your brother. <laughs> Hear Jesus, somebody has offended you. Instead of waiting for the person to ask for forgiveness, he's saying, you go and tell him his fault. But if he will not hear you, take with you one or two more, that by the mouth of two or three witnesses, every word may be established. And if he refuses to hear them, tell it to the church. But if he refuses even to hear the church, let him be to you a heathen and a task collector. And see, a, B, C of forgiveness. A is avoid revenge. B is build bridges. And C, control anger. You know, you can be angry. It is legitimate. Even Jesus was angry. But you need to manage your anger. Watch your words or behavior. Your anger should not linger. Don't justify your anger. Because anger opens the door to the devil. You know, if you want to forgive, learn to release the guilty person. Love everyone. Bless and pray for people. And do not bring up the earth in the future. Thank you.